name's Josh Knepper. This is my lovely assistant, Akone Kama. We are here at the 2006 Paul Mitchell Mount Board Championships right here at the beautiful, where are we? Snowmass Village, That's Colorado. Right. It's amazing. There's going to be all kinds of crazy mountain board action going on, so stick around and check it out. And here's the action. We got the final rounds from the Youth Sport Master and Pro Divisions. We'll be checking out the dirt border cross as these four-man heats down the crazy track, as well as the slope style competition. That's the huge roll-in with the kickers, the gaps, the landings. We've got rainbow rails, flat rails, hips, and of course, the snowmass rebate wall. All right, up here at the village, they have an amazing youth mountain board camp called the Dirt Dogs. And my buddy Doug Webb heads that up. He's had Jeremy Leaf and a bunch of other pros hanging out with him the last couple weeks, helping these guys make it down the course. They're having their races right now. It's awesome. It's a great place to learn how to mountain board. If you're a beginner, they got brakes and all kinds of stuff like that to help you safely down the hill. It's amazing. It's all happening right here at Snowmass Village. And they are still racing. It's, these guys are amazing. I can't believe it. They're like 12 years and younger. Awesome, I love it. Here we have the youth division. We got Connor Gleason, Calvin O'Brien, Jeff Woolley, part of Doug Webb's Dirt Dogs, and Mason Moore taking the whole shot there in front from Utah. Nice lead right out of the gate, holds it strong all the way through Calvin right behind him, but loses his footing right there and gives up his possible second place. Now Jeff and Connor are battling out for second. Mason Moore definitely taking first, a walk in the park for him. Right behind him coming in second place is Jeff Woolley, followed by Connor Gleason and fourth, Calvin O'Brien. All right, dude, here I am with Mason Moore. He's 15 years old. He's been riding since May, all right? What month is this now? July. It's July. Okay, that's not a, a lot of time, all right? You just took first place in the youth division. How did you pull that off? I don't know. I just followed my lines, pumped everything as hard as I could, made sure I stayed in front, got the whole shot. Okay, now, but I, now when I say how did you do that, because you've only been riding for like, like I can count how many months you've been riding on one hand, okay? <laughs> right. So what did you do to prepare for this day? I rode at Tanner Park. Tanner Park? That's in uh, Utah. Yeah, Utah. Yeah, and who who do you ride with out there? I ride with Van Duet. Van Duet and the Dirt Star crew? Yeah. All right, so he's taking you under his wing and uh, showing you what's up, huh? Yeah, pretty much. So you can pretty much say, I owe all of my riding skills to Van Duet. And the Dirt Star crew. All right, and the Dirt Star crew. And your natural ability as, as a prodigy mountain boarder, right? Yeah. You're like, dude, you're making me blush. All right, well, congratulations <laughs> on the first place win here at 2006 Mountain Board Championships in Snowmass. Congrat, dude, I'm still like in awe that you pulled that off. Thanks. The guy's like a baby and he's been riding for days and uh, that's it, I'm, I'm walking away. <laughs> oh, we're ready. Hey, my name's Josh and I'm here with Doug Webb, the master of the Dirt Dogs here at beautiful Snowmass. Tell me a little about what you do here. Speaking to the net. I'm joking. All we do here is promote having a good time. We have fun, we help the kids mountain board. That's about it. We watch them, we coach them, and we're their buddies too. What's their average age, the riders? You know, we're looking at anywhere from, I believe, 7 to 14. Wow. So somewhere right in there. Nice. So you're starting them early. <laughs> we, like to, we like to raise them how we want them. That's good. And this guy is also an insane ripper himself. All right. So you got to check out all the action here that's going on at the 2006 Mountain Board Championships. Doug Webb, thank you very much for teaching all these young guys how it's done. Thanks for having me. Thanks for coming to Snowmass. Anytime. Come on out. All right. It's good to Check it out, we'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. <laughs> the 2006 Paul Mitchell US Open Mountain Board Championships is being brought to you by Paul Mitchell, putting the style in lifestyle sports. MBS, always riding. The town of Snowmass Village, we have more. DiscoverColorado.com, it's time to DiscoverColorado.com. And a special thanks to Snowmass Ski Area, high in the Rocky Mountains. All right, here we are at the U.S. Open Board Across Course. It's man-on-man -man racing, four guys down at a time, double round elimination, bumps, jumps, turns, berms. How does it break down? Well, yeah, we got four-man heat, so you got four guys in this gate right here. They say, ready, steady, go. We drop that gate. These guys take off down all these whoops. We got five berms, multiple tabletops, all kinds of obstacles that get in your way. Plus, you also got your neighbor rubbing shoulders with you while you're going down the hill. So it's a lot of fun. It's going to be sick and insane. Go. 
Yeah, tell me, was there any girl and girl action today? I don't know. I was trying to be out in the front, so I don't want to see what's going on behind me. I'm off for the girl and girl action. Maybe later on you tonight. You guys rock. <laughs> Ooh. All right, now we have the sport division. Peter Nelson, Chris Adams, Jaden McGraw, and Jason Keenan in the gate. Jason with the whole shot and out front first, followed closely by J.D. McGraw into berm number one. There they all go into the doubles and around berm number two. First set of whoops, keeping the same line into that first table is Jason, J.D. They come into the berm and they both go down. They take out each other as does Chris. Peter Nelson gets off track. J.D. McGraw is now in the lead, followed by Jason Keenan. Chris Adams close behind in third. JD goes down, giving Jason Keenan the chance at first place. It looks like he's going to take it as long as he stays on his board. Chris Adams closely behind him for the second place, leaving JD McGraw coming in for third and the red caboose, Peter Nelson, coming in fourth. All right, here's our master's division. We got Gene Lott, Bill Miller, Brian Hill, Billy Souther, Don Baker. Bill with the lead, the whole shot right out of the gate, followed closely by Gene. We got Hillbilly right there in the back and Don Baker taking a safe fourth place. Berm number two, Bill still in the lead, nice speed, but getting a little wobbly here and he hits the tabletop. And all of a sudden, Hillbilly flying down, taking out Gene and Bill Miller keeps it, is in first place. Don Baker right behind him in second. Bill Miller goes down, quite an upset for him. Don Baker now in the lead, only has two more tabletops to go for a definite first place. Bill Miller trying to get up and get enough speed to take second, but Hillbilly passes him up for the second place win. Bill Miller finally makes the finish line at third place, and coming in fourth is Gene Lott. Crazy action right there in the Masters division. Dude, the man Don Baker right hey, here. Hey, what's the happening? 2006 Masters National Mountain Board Champion. Woo! Yeah! One of the greatest moments of my life, watching you cross that finish line in first place. Thank Tell you. me what's going on in your head right now. Oh, unbelievable. After breaking my leg, being here with a full cast last year, mm -hmm. didn't even bring my border equipment, borrowed some pads and a board and decided, wait, this looks like too much fun. I just want to be a part of this. I <laughs> uh, had no idea, you know, come out on top, but. Dude, we're so glad you found that board and those pads and you came out yeah, here. Yeah, I want to thank Gene, <laughs> Gene from Texas. All right, here we have the women's division. We got Kelly Jamison and Paige Niehassel in the red. Doug Webb's Dirt Dogs race it against Carolyn Kunkel and Nancy Ng. Kelly up front in the red with the duck on her helmet. We got Carolyn Kunkel right behind her in the blue. Nancy Ng closely in third. And there you have it, berm two. There's the changeup. Carolyn Kunkel and Nancy taking over first and second position, heading for the first big table. And Carolyn goes down, taking Nancy with her and Kelly. This does not affect Paige. She's gonna come in for that first position. And Carolyn's up. Paige goes down, giving up that first position. Carolyn's back up, followed by Nancy into berm three. Here they go. They're neck and neck. It looks like Nancy gets the pass. She is now in the lead, followed by Carolyn Kunkel. We got Kelly in third. This is quite a win for Dirthead. Nancy Ng in first place, followed by Carolyn Kunkel in second, Kelly Jameson in third, and Paige Niehassel in fourth. Check it out, I'm down here with Nancy Ng, the women's division, 2006 Mountain Board National Champion. That was some amazing riding, all right, dude? I saw you pull some stuff on that course that I didn't think was possible. But first off, just tell me how you feel right now. Incredibly stoked, I can't believe I got it back. Yeah, that was amazing. Just some of the passes, like I saw you with Carolyn, like right in front of you, and you're like, uh-uh, uh-uh. This year, it's my year, and, that, and it is, right? It certainly is. You've been, you've been riding solid pretty much all year, and now you came out here and you proved it to us all that you still got it. Pretty much, that's what I'm here for. All right, so what are you gonna do now? I think I'm gonna go um, try some freestyle stuff. All so right, you're gonna go, go hit there. the slope style. Oh yeah. You're gonna show us off, you know, some more of your tricks. I'm gonna sure try. All right, that sounds good. Ladies and gentlemen, Nancy Ng, the women's 2006 Mountain Board National Champions. Oh, I'm so excited. I, let's just go have a Red Bull. All right. All right, here comes the pro finals. Let's see what Leon Robbins is thinking. Feeling good. I got one practice run in and I stuck it clean. So if I can do that in the final, I'll be happy. Hopefully nobody can catch up with me. <laughs> All right, here's our pro division right out of the gate. It looks like Justin Dersham got the whole shot. Leon Robbins by behind him. Oh, but Joel is in the front now. 
with Justin and Leon right behind him. Leon, nice double on there. They are now in first and second. Joel Lee and Leon Robbins around berm three. Nice speed off that table, leaving the other two in the dust. Oh, and Jason, small dog, small. Justin Dersham go down, leaving Joel Lee and Leon Robbins battling for first and second. It's neck to neck right now. Leon Robbins doubling him up. Who's it going to be? It's Joel Lee with the first place win, followed by Leon Robbins in second. Jason Small coming down in right now for third place, followed by Justin Dersham in fourth. Amazing pro racing right there. No longer stuck in the shadow of his older brother. Oh, I said it. That's right. Taking first place at the 2006 Mount Moore Championships. How do you feel? I feel good. I feel really good. <laughs> long time coming, so it's nice to have it. Very long time coming. Yeah. I've been racing with you for years and years, yeah. and you're always right there. And But you know what, dude? You left Leon in the dust and Jason Small. That's hard to do, it was right? Hard. Yeah, definitely. It was. Uh, I mean, that's border cross. It comes down to luck a lot of times. I got the whole shot. First time the whole weekend, all the practice rounds. I missed the whole shot and I got it. I thought, this is my chance, my chance to beat Lee. <laughs> All right, let's catch up with last year's overall mount board champion, Jeremy Leaf, and find out why he wasn't out here racing to defend his title. I've been mountain boarding for like five years, and every year I've entered the U.S. Open, I've won the men's pro freestyle. So four years running, and you know, hope to go for five this year, but uh, earlier this season, it's unfortunate, didn't have wrist pads on, and I fell and dislocated my wrist. So, had my ticket already, so I figured I'd come up, helped out with the kids' camp. Kids are great up here. And, you know, helped out shaping the course and whatever else I could do. I'm judging and, you know, still being put to use up here if I can't ride. All right, so don't go anywhere. Come right back if you do for some amazing mountboard slope style. That's going to be right after this. <laughs> Right now we're back. What are we back for, Josh? Slope style. Slope style. We're at Snowmass Village, Colorado. 2006 Paul Mitchell Mount Board Championships. Ah! All right, here we are at the dirt slope style part of our competition. The pro man get to start atop of a huge 20-foot rolling ramp, reaching speeds of up to 35 miles an hour on the flat bottom. They hit a five-foot kicker, fly through the air. After they land, you get a chance to hit a rainbow rail, fun box, all kinds of other smaller kickers, and then the snow mass rebate wall. The women, however, get to start on their own part of the mountain, where they'll hit the hips, they get a chance to hit three different size kickers and then three different rails and all the way up the rebate wall. All right, let's start off with the women's division. Taking home third place, we got Nancy Ng. Her first run there, gets some nice height off the center jump. Second run, going for the front side 180 that time. Third run, taking a nice 50-50 on the kink rail. Almost going down, but keeping it all together, making up the snowmass rebate wall. Taking home second place, we got Colleen Mooney with her first run there. Nice height off that center jump, making her way down towards the kinked rail with the 50-50 on and off, making her way up the rebate wall. Nice spin. And on her second run, going for another 50-50 on the kinked rail. Taking home first place, we got Carolyn Kunkel. Nice height off that center jump, making her way towards the kinked rail, 50-50 on and off, and making her way all the way up to the top almost of the snowmass rebate wall. That'll leave a mark. Now it's time to check out some of the highlights from the pro men's qualifying and semifinal rounds. All right, later on, we got the Dirt Slope Style Pro Men Finals coming up. But first, let's check out a grassroots tribute to mountain boarding from Dirt Star Army.
right, so this is as soft as it gets, right here. You see this? This is what we're riding on. Rocks and dirt, because that's the way we like it. When you go down, you go down hard. And we're gonna check out some of the most amazing, gnarliest crashes that have happened in the last few days. All right, okay? Not for the faint of heart. Keep those eyes open. Try it exactly like that. <laughs> when we come back, we'll see who survived and who gets crowned the overall champion. The 2006 Paul Mitchell U.S. Open Mountain Board Championships have been brought to you by Paul Mitchell, putting the style in lifestyle sports, MBS, always riding, the town of Snowmass Village, we have more, discovercolorado.com. It's time to discover Colorado.com. And a special thanks to Snowmass Ski Area, high in the Rocky Mountains. All right, so we're gonna go to Susan right now. She's down in the Snowmass Village. She's gonna tell us a little bit more about this beautiful place that is Snowmass. The commitment is pretty obvious from the start. Aspen Snowmass Skiing Company and the town of Snowmass Village embraced the championships of this sport from the very start, and that's the Paul Mitchell U.S. Open Mountain Boarding Championships, and it's presented by the town of Snowmass Village and the Aspen Skiing Company. Um, the commitment to the trails, to hosting this fabulous event, which is out here this weekend. You'll see these crazy kids doing some fabulous stunts. It's just, it's just amazing. We're, we're pleased to have it, and so that, that demonstrates the commitment that we've made from the very start, and we're still with it and proud to be. All right, we're back for the dirt slope style finals for the pro men. These guys get five jumps. They take the best three out of five in their score. Remember, you can pull a sick trick in the air, but if you don't land it, it does not count. Like Sean Biles' double backflip attempt right there and then taking one for the team. Can you say, ouch? All right, taking third place, we got Starfighter 63, Dave Stiefvater, with 360 variations in the grab right there. Huge one-footers. The guy is unstoppable when it comes to those. Going for the 50-50 on the kink rail. And nice style on the rebate wall. Yes, style does count. Coming in second place, we got small dog Jason Small. Huge lofty backflip landing way down at the bottom. Frontside board slide and then taking one down right there. Jason Small for his second round. Huge 540 attempt, his third round, the backside 360, keeping it smooth, making his way past the rainbow rail and up the rebate wall. Jason Small taking a second place. First place going Leon Robbins with the backflip none right there. Coming down for the rainbow rail, front side board slide. 180 out, second run. Huge backside 180 in the grab. And for his third run, huge backside 360 tail grab, bringing it around switch to board slide on the rainbow rail and off. First place in slope style, second place in board across, which makes him the overall champion. Dude, coming up next, we're gonna be hanging out with the Dirty Girls, the most amazing women in the sport. Hi, my name is Colleen Mooney. I'm from Salt Lake City, Utah, and I'm just an all-around border girl, any terrain, any type of board, I'll shut it up. So there are girly girls out there who want to ride, but they don't want people to treat them like a guy just because they put up with all the other hard things that go along with riding. Hi, my name is Tiffany Ecker. I'm from Littleton, Colorado. I'm a pro rider for MBS, Go Fast, Harbinger, and Dirtheads. Mountain boarding is a cross between mountain biking, snowboarding, and skateboarding. It's the all-terrain board of any board sport. You can take it anywhere, sticks, grass, rocks, skate parks, dirt tracks, anywhere that your heart desires. My name is Nancy Ng. I live in South Lake Tahoe, California. And I'm a pro mountain boarder for Ground Industries, Dirtheads Mountain Boarding Team, and Shoreline Ski and Sport in Stateline, Nevada. Mountain boarding is an awesome way for me to spend my summer. I started out as a snowboarder and missed it all summer until I started mountain boarding. Now, I love all seasons, all year round, because I can always be riding a board. Hi, my name is Carolyn Kunkel, otherwise known as Sea roll I'm from Amityville, New York. My sponsors are 
MBS mountain boards, hillbilly protective wear. Mountain boarding means to me fun, just having a good time with my friends, riding terrain that normally wouldn't be able to ride. And it's just a good time and a good cross training device to help me stay in shape for snowboarding. A big congratulations to all the competitors in all the divisions who worked their way up through the brackets and dirtboard across and survived dirt slope style to earn themselves a podium position. And a big congratulations to all the staff who pulled off another amazing event. Nepper here with the Dirty Girls. Thanks for coming out and watching the 2006 Mountain Board Championships brought to you by Paul Mitchell and the lovely town of Snowmass Village. Did you ladies have a good time? Yeah! Oh yeah, I know I did watching you on the mountain and the slope style. It was amazing. Come back next year and check it out. Thank you again to all of our sponsors and to everybody. Hey, have you guys seen a Coney? Where's he at? He was around here somewhere. Oh hey, there he is right there. All right, sick of Coney, get him! Thanks for coming out. Next year, we'll see you here at Snowmass for the 2007 Mountain Board Championships. In goes Carolyn. That's how it is with the Dirty Girls. They are now the clean girls. Thank you. Bye-bye. The sun. Dirt Cloud Racing. The sun. The sun yeah. is definitely beating us down today. Yeah, I can't see a thing.